Hello, welcome. Let's try to know about the AppGate utility. I will demonstrate two options of AppGate install and remove. Let me first open the terminal. I hope this is visible. Let's say I need to install a package named SL. So, first I will see if SL is currently installed. So, it's not installed correctly and it's saying to install SL by using sudo apt-get install SL. So, sudo is for the root permissions. I type sudo apt-get install SL. So, this fetches the data from the internet and installs SL. So, now SL is installed. SL package runs a train on the terminal. Now, let's install a package named Vajig. It's currently not installed. So, I do it as sudo apt-get install logic it's a uh, front end for the apt get utility so the jig is installed so you get a jig prompt there i quit currently next let's try to remove a package using the apt get tool it's similar to the install utility you need to append sudo and instead of install use remove so let's remove a package say sl itself it asks or confirms me to whether to continue or not with the removal of the package I say yes and now the package is removed so sl command no longer exists we can also use the plus and minus symbols along with the install and remove options say sudo apt get uh, to install sl I may also use remove sl but with the plus symbol so this installs the package sl similarly as with the install now let me remove the package sl by using the install option sl but followed by a minus symbol uh, without any spaces so this removes sl i say s so sl is removed again finally if you want to install any package just type sudo followed by the apt get utility name and install option followed by the package say let install a game open arena just type open arena and press enter it confirms me whether to continue or not i say yes and now it's working so thank you for watching till here in the next session or in the next part let's try to know further about the app gate utility